have found even small amounts of stress might contribute to developing type 2 diabetes. They believe the discovery could be key to preventing the disease, affecting millions of Australians. Retiree Glenn Lewis was shocked when he was diagnosed with type 2 diabetes four years ago. I was very surprised. I was shocked actually because I felt I'd lived a pretty healthy lifestyle. But his lifestyle might not have been the only factor putting him at risk. Scientists have long believed there's a link between stress and diabetes, and a recent study is showing that link could be even stronger than first thought. What this research suggests to us is that even very low levels of stress, which you, a person might not necessarily be aware of, um, appear to be increasing the, the development of type 2 diabetes. Griffith University professor John Hedrick and his team have done modelling using animals. The study partly funded by Diabetes Australia. It showed very low levels of stress, not unlike what most humans are exposed to in everyday life, combined Western diet with a little bit of extra fat produce some shocking results. Suddenly they're beginning to show signs of diabetes and suddenly they're showing signs of depression. People with diabetes are more likely to suffer depression and heart disease. Scientists believe stress could be a link between these conditions and ultimately the key to preventing it. It could be quite subtle changes in lifestyle that uh, can both lead to disease and, and conversely protect against disease. Glenn hopes scientists will learn more about how to manage and reverse diabetes in his lifetime. I want to be around for a long time yet. You know, I've got five kids, ten grandkids, and they're all growing up. Ebony Cavallaro, Nine News.